The Union Aerospace Corporation is the largest corporate entity in existence. Originally focused on weapon and defense contracts, new ventures have expanded into biological research, space exploration, and other scientific endeavors. With unlimited funds and the ability to engage in research outside of moral and legal obligations, the UAC controls the most advanced technology ever conceived. Incoming transport detected. Mars approach, Dark Star with U07063, passing through 38000. Roger, Dark Star, descend to 2000, set speed, contact ground on 26972. Roger that tower. We have them on radar, sir. They'll be landing in a few moments. Excellent. See that Counselor Swan is sent directly to me. Yes, sir. Tower, Dark Star on final. We've got you, Dark Star. You are set for lockdown. Welcome back. I didn't want to come here. He left you no choice. True, but this is the last time. I'm tired of running damage control every time he makes a mess. Right. You're the control, and if that fails, I'm the damage. If that's what it takes, the Truger is going to start doing things our way. Whatever you say, Counselor. Welcome to Mars. 
All new arrivals Welcome need to, to Mars check City, in Union Aerospace's premier research I facility. Get out of to expedite here. your processing, please proceed directly I'm to reception. Off this rock, and you should too. If you're staying here, watch your back. Welcome to Mars, Marine. I'm gonna need you to step on one of those red squares on the floor for a bioscan. This'll only take a second. Okay, let me get this started. You're gonna need to hold still. Moving around only makes the test take longer. All right, bioscan looks good. You're cleared for entry. On behalf of the UAC, welcome to Mars City. This facility serves as the central hub for all scientific research, Attention. archaeological Director study, Banks. and military Please report operations. to Central Administration. Goal number one at the UAC is the safety and well-being of all employees and guests. To help achieve this goal, we ask you to follow... Welcome to Mars. First time? You can just leave your bag there. I'll have it sent up to your quarters. Okay, there's a few things we need to take care of first. This is your personal data assistant. You'll need this to access all secure areas. If you get clearance for any security zones, it'll download directly. It's important, so don't lose it. I see here that Sergeant Kelly has requested your immediate attention. Head directly to Marine Command. It's just that way. Follow the signs. Mars City is a smoke-free facility. Please smoke only in designated areas. Thank you for your cooperation. Haven't seen you before. You must be with that new detachment coming to check on us. Is there some type of problem? I'm just trying to get my work done here. I'm trying to get these systems reconfigured so I can't talk now. I'm here because there seems to be some very serious problems. Oh, really? Do I need to remind you of the groundbreaking work that we're doing here? No, but I've been authorized by the board to look at everything. The board authorized you? Hmm. The board doesn't know the first thing about science. All they want is something to make them more money, some product. Don't worry, they'll get their product. After how many accidents? Tell me, Dr. Petruger, why are so many workers spooked complaining requesting transfers off Mars? They simply can't handle life here. They're exhausted and overworked. If I had a larger, more competent staff and bigger budget, even these few accidents could have been avoided. I'm afraid you'll get nothing more until my report is filed with the board. I will need full access, Dr. Petruger, Delta included. I won't have any difficulties doing that, will I? Only if you get lost, Swan. Just stay out of my way. Amazing things will happen here soon. You just wait. Let's go. Listen, buddy, you don't have clearance for this area. Move along. I can't help you here. Head to Marine Command. They can help you. I don't think I've seen you before. You must be a replacement for one of the guys we lost. Try not to let this place get in your head. Just stay focused on your job. You'll be back on Earth before you know it. Yeah, 
I saw those suits arrive too. Weird. You ain't seem like you were about something like IPN News Network, your universe now. The Union Aerospace Corporation denied allegations today of several reports showing a growing military presence ah, on Mars. Someone new. A spokesperson it's always nice seeing new faces around here. Hope you enjoy your stay. Deployment to outlying planetary sectors. Authorities continue to search for the activists. This is the audio log of maintenance technician Adam Bernache, dated November 10th, 2145. I fixed the couplings on the heat shields this morning with no problems. I did, however, have another odd experience while I was down there. Shortly after finishing the first coupling adjustment, I've been here I distinctly four heard years. my advice. When I went to investigate the sound, he said he just nothing. lost it. Another new checked the work logs, Welcome and I was the only person scheduled to be in that area today. That experience, coupled with the stories I've heard from some guys over in the Delta Labs, has me pretty freaked out. I'm really beginning to hate going down to the underground maintenance area. The people down there are a bit off. The mumbling, the weird looks. The whole place is just plain creepy. Super turbo I'm always expecting puncher. someone to jump Three. out of me. I've secured my tools and the busted modulator in the storage cabinet next to the maintenance elevator. Technicians should use cabinet code 396 to access them. End of log. Another replacement, huh? Listen up, newbie. I'll give you some advice. Keep your eyes open and stay focused. Yeah, I see people come and go around here all the time. Wonder how long you'll last. Come back for a drink when you get some free time. Listen up, newbie. I'll give you some advice. The place is always Keep open. Your eyes open. If you want to come stay by focused. and forget. Accidents? That's good. Is that what they're calling him now? So, tell me. Look, all I do is repair the converters when they blow, okay? That's it. Fine. What kind of power do they need? I wouldn't ask him if I was you, man. I heard Travis started poking around and he got transferred fast. Didn't even see him leave. Hell, no one saw him go. He was here one minute, gone the next. Lucky bastard. Marine Command is right around the corner. Why don't you go bother someone there? I'm really trying to get this fixed quickly, so, uh, do you mind? Listen, I'd love to talk, but I'm really busy. If you can fix this, you can stay and help, but otherwise, get going. Attention, Dr. Braddock, please report to Environment Management Office for You need to report Alpha. to Sergeant Kelly ASAP. He's in Command HQ. Don't waste any more time. Go see the Sarge. I can't be interrupted now. I've got work to finish. Okay. He's sedated now. Please don't disturb me. Can't you see I'm busy? Trying to reconfigure this little guy. I can't talk now. Don't you have some orders you need to be following? Took your sweet time, Marine. Now, here's the situation. Another member of the science team's gone missing. Since you're the ranking FNG, you get to find him. I want you to check out the old decommissioned comm facility. I heard he might be heading that way. The only way there is through the service passage under Mars City. I've programmed this sentry to guide you to the maintenance elevator. 
Hope you followed the sentry better than you've followed orders so far. We'll pick up some gear at the security checkpoint at the bottom of the elevator. Oh, and when you find him, just bring him back. Do not hurt him. Now move out. Didn't you hear, Sarge? He gave you a mission. Move out, Marine. No time to talk, bud. We both got work to do. This is the audio log of maintenance technician Adam Bernache, dated November 10th, 2145. I fixed the couplings on the heat shields this morning with no problems. I did, however, have another odd experience while I was down there. Shortly after finishing the first coupling adjustment, I distinctly heard whispering. When I went to investigate the sounds, I found nothing. I checked the work logs and I was the only person scheduled to be in that area today. That experience, coupled with the stories I've heard from some guys over that Delta Labs, has me pretty freaked out. I'm really beginning to hate going down to the underground maintenance area. The people down there are a bit off. The mumbling, the weird looks. The whole place is just plain creepy. I'm always expecting someone to jump out at me. I've secured my tools and the busted modulator in the storage cabinet next to the maintenance elevator. Technicians should use cabinet code 396 to access them. End of log. Attention UAC personnel. Interested in earning more credits? Volunteer at Delta Labs today. See your service branch director for more details. UAC cares about the quality of life of its employees. Please take advantage of our quality medical care services. Not a lot to do around here, but watch your back. Welcome to the dungeon, Marine. Most unexciting place on Mars. I'm gonna need you to grab some armor and secure your pistol before I can pass you through security. Okay, grab your gear. Now you're ready for combat. Let me do a radio test. Mars Sec radio check. Excellent. Good signal. Looks like you've been assigned the decommissioned comm facility. Just follow the main passage through the underground junction, then straight out. You'll have a quick evac. And what better way to see the Martian surface than to run across it? Okay, you're all set. Oh yeah, keep in mind, civilians are working down here. Don't get excited and shoot any.
I'm not sure you want to find him. You see... Uh, uh, never mind. Don't listen to me. Never mind what I said. Yourself. Because I'm getting paid to make sure you do it. Just finish the coupling so we can continue. Buddy, don't know if I can really help you with anything. Kind of busy here. Boss? Uh. Hey, what the hell's going on up there? This is Grant Baston, the Environmental Services Supervisor. The date is October 19th. I've been hearing an alarming number of reports on some, uh, unexplainable things. Being on another planet and working underground has always been a little spooky, so we always have the occasional report of strange things. But what is worrying me is the fact that the number of these reports are up by a lot. People are truly frightened. The rumors we're hearing about experiments from the Delta Complex are not helping. Not any the power fluctuations aren't helping at all either. The Having the lights flicker constantly and losing power for several minutes at a time is scaring everyone down here. Well, I'm doing my best to keep people in track, but we're continually short-handed. Someone's reporting in sick almost every day. Jeez! I'll keep my director apprised of the situation. You make a habit of sneaking we'll up on people? Reports as I get them. Everyone's already on edge down here with all the strange things that have been going on. The garage area is right through that door. Now stop bothering me. The equipment seems to be affected by something unseen. The equipment seems to be affected by something unseen. Uh, uh. Center, right? You'd better hustle up, pal. This passage doesn't go all the way there. You'll have a quick walk outside to the center's airlock. Man, hey, don't sweat it. Your suit's got plenty of oxygen. Well, what the hell are you waiting for, Marine?
Marine, this is Sergeant Kelly. You need to double time it down there. Search your assigned area and haul your ass back to Mars City. Out. You must let me get this communication out. They have to be warned while there is still time. Systems I can't let... I, you don't know what I've seen. You can't possibly understand or comprehend. The devil is real. I know. I built his cage. I'm getting abnormal readings here. This is bad. God. We can't hold these levels. We're losing it! <laughs> Again, fall back to Marine HQ and await further orders. Leaders, give sit rest. Over. Command HQ, this is Bravo Team. We've got one Marine down, two wounded. Command HQ, this is Fire Team 4. We are pinned down in Alpha Land. Command HQ, this is Fire Team 2. Main power systems down at sub level. Backup and life support systems only. We've got lots of civilian casualties. It's a mess. Command HQ, attempting to secure the area. This is the audio log of Frank Delahue, engineering manager assigned to power production dated October 18, 2145. 
The current operational status of the grid is 23% over nominal capacity. I've increased work shifts to 12 hours a day for all personnel to keep up with demand. The constant and increasing load from the Delta complex is causing havoc. We are going to start losing critical systems if we have to sustain these levels much longer. I request clearance to requisition parts from other departments in order to maintain our equipment. Okay, I don't know what is going on over in Delta, but I'm doing all I can down here. The constant demands are bad enough, but the rumors going around are making things a whole lot worse. And I gotta tell you, things don't get better soon. All hell is gonna break loose. All units, this is Sergeant Kelly. We don't know what we're up against. Repeat, we have negative ID on the assailing force. They're mean SOPs. You don't have a clear path back to HQ. Stock up on ammo, establish a stronghold, and keep them at bay. 